Hey, welcome back to the Dapper House. In today's video, we're gonna be doing another Stitch Fix unboxing. Now let's get started. This is going to be our third video, my 12th box overall. I'm pretty excited about it. Um, I left some notes in the last one and I'm really looking forward to seeing um, what Stitch Fix sent me. One thing I would like to note and let everyone know is Stitch Fix actually does give you a preview of your box if you, if you wanna look at it. And then obviously when you need to check out, um, you have to go there and it lists all the items and everything as well. So if you're a little impatient, um, you can't always go down that option. However, I do think it's kind of fun to, you know, open it up and see what you get. Um, oh, I do look, I see there's potentially some shoes as well. So that's always a nice little item to get. Uh, we got the big, um, about looks like four pieces of items, four pieces of clothing here. And then lastly, you know, just the priority mail um, return envelope and then also we, we see great things and compliments in your future, so the envelope that comes with it as well. So let's go ahead and unpack this up and see what we got. So let's do this one a little bit differently this time. Let's take a look at the envelope first and see what's in here. So the first thing I notice is obviously the, well, hello there. That's always kind of fun as noted before. And then on the other item, we have, you know, the cost of everything, each item kind of detailed out, the color, the size and everything as well. And then we have the major styling item here where it gives kind of like tips and different ways to wear these items and also the note on the top right. Now let's take a look at what Jessica had to say. Thanks for joining us for another fix. My name is Jessica and I'm excited to be styling you. I know you said during your last fix that you have too many pants right now, so I made sure to focus on tops for the colder weather rolling into Louisville and a great pair of shoes, of course. Let's jump right in and check out those Garner Leather Chuckas from Ride by Rocker High. These are perfect because you can dress them up for a bit for a day at work, or you can pair them with your favorite jeans and button down for a date night. I also included the Omaha Chambray shirt for you because it makes a really great layering piece. I know that pockets on short sleeve shirts aren't your favorite, but toss this on, layer that quarter zip over it and some jeans in those chuckas, and let me know what you think. Cheers, Jessica. So I really do appreciate that level of personalization they went there. Um, they noticed some of the things I said in the past, they uh, took that into consideration and she overall I think put together you know a pretty good piece so let's go ahead and open up each item and see what it looks like let's take a look so open them up as noticed before these nice uh, black chukkas uh, one thing to note on this and Dapper John actually pointed this out pretty early um, they do have a black and brown mixture there which we typically um, wouldn't recommend so I am taking that in consideration with these However, they look overall pretty nice. They look clean. It's always kind of cool to get some shoes here as well. And uh, it seems like they may pair with the other items. So I'm pretty happy to at least try them on. Let's take a look at them further. Uh, let's go into the big boy over here now. Um, instantly style your fix with everything. And we have this nice turquoise shirt that I think looks, uh, I'm honestly, I really like this color. Uh, it typically goes well with my eyes. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty pleased with it overall. Um, long sleeve, which is, Always good, it's as noted, it's gonna get a little colder here so I can wear this as well. Um, pretty excited to try this on, hopefully it fits, but I, I definitely appreciate and enjoy the color. I think it's it's pretty cool. Next we have here the uh, Rocker Hawker Rye Omaha Short Sleeve Stretch ch Chambray Shirt. Um, let's take a look at this, it's a little bit thicker, as kind of noted, it's short sleeve. Not a huge fan of that, also not a huge fan of the pocket. Um, these aren't my favorite style shirts, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, but I will try it on, at least see if it fits, but this one very well may be back. Next we have here, ooh, this one kind of feels, it's pretty heavy, hefty, uh, which is good. Flag and Anthem, Santana textured shawl collared sweater. Uh, these are absolutely perfect for winter. Um, this nice, like olive color uh, looks fantastic. Um, I think it's gonna be great to try on. I think it's gonna fit with a lot of my clothes. So dark gray actually, uh, medium. I'm pretty excited to try this on. I think it's gonna look good. I think it's gonna pair well. Um, also kind of want to try out the turquoise. Um, that could be an interesting look. Next we have, and lastly we have here, the Fairlane and Sons Berry Textured Quarter Zip uh, Color Burgundy. At least that's what it says. <laughs> um, I think this is more of a, a darker blue here. But that's okay, a um, little bit. This is still, honestly, uh, one of my favorite styles of shirts. I, I think these fit really well. I think they pair over a lot of good things. They're easy, nice to wear in the office. Um, so definitely excited to try this on and see how it fits. Um, first, we have the Omaha Short Sleeve Stretch Shirt. 
was not a huge fan of this shirt. It goes for $55. I'm going to be returning it. Um, it's getting chillier here in winter. It's not something I necessarily need. With the pocket, it's just not an item I like. Um, I'll let her know that um, and we kind of go on to the next one. Next is the Oxford uh, sport shirt, the tur turquoise shirt here. I was actually a big fan of this shirt. I think it's a great color. I think it's a unique color. If I was to go out to a store, I don't think this is a color I would typically pick out right away. So I think that adds to the wardrobe effect there. It is $68, so I'm gonna take that in consideration. But overall, a nice long sleeve shirt like this, uh, that's different color, is, is definitely appreciated. Next, I have the Garnered Leather Chuckas here. Um, I think these were nice. I, I, if they fit, I may keep them. My only caveat there is again, the brown and black is not a, the best look in the world. However, these are a nice casual shoe that can kind of maybe even get dirty a little bit, um, you know, take out to the bar if, if it's raining one night. Uh, they have their place and I, I think they can also be very, pretty pretty nice to wear as well. Um, next, I have the very textured quarter zip. So again, I do like a good quarter zip. I think they look fantastic. Uh, they can look really good on you. The only issue I have with this one in particular is it's $52. Um, one, this is where I want to go on where I, where I think about Stitch Fix overall. Um, for $52, I think that's a little bit steep uh, when they bring it in. I could go out to a TJ Maxx, Target, you know, a, a Macy's and go find a quarter zip like this, you know, for $20 or $30. That's very similar in nature, similar quality, uh, but I have to go out and find it. And now if I wanted to go out and find each one of these items at, you know, one of those stores, it'd take me, let's say, two to three hours, but I could find everything and probably sell, save myself, you know, 50 bucks, which is great, which is nice. Uh, where Stitch Fix does come in is they do give some styling tips and some ideas. Uh, with that said, the last item on here is the textured shawl uh, towel. And with this collared shirt, I don't know if I would have ever like gone out and bought one or thought about buying one. Now that they kind of present it to me and give me that idea, um, I can certainly keep this item for $69.50, uh, which is again, a little steep. I could probably go out to a TJ Maxx, et cetera, and find one you know easily for 50 bucks that is very similar quality. However, there is that convenience factor. I'd have to go out there, find the item, try it on, make sure it fit, and then purchase it. Is that worth it to you? If you're keeping a couple of these items or you don't like keep in tune um, with fashion or types of different, you know, keeping your wardrobe up to date. A Stitch Fix is really great about that. If, however, you like to go to TJ Maxx, you like to go to Target, you like to shop for your clothes in particular, um, Stitch Fix might not be the right service for you. Um, and one thing to note is, you know, we're not sponsored by Stitch Fix or any of the companies we present. Uh, we want to give you information that's helpful to you. And so hopefully, uh, kind of thinking about that way offers a little bit of value in regards to if this is a service you'd like to give. If it is, there is a link below and please, you know, click on it. Uh, there, it does help in regards to like, I get $25, I think you get $25 if you click on it. If this video helped um, make a decision there, then certainly do so. Um, I think Stitch Fix overall, I, I, I do like it. I do enjoy getting the items. If I just wanted to keep one of these, it maybe cost me 50 bucks every two months and I get an item. And I also get to see all these other, like maybe I want to go out and go purchase some Chuck that's now they sent me these, I sent them back. Uh, that's just another way to kind of look at it. So make your decision. I will appreciate it. I think this Stitch Fix box, uh, this one in particular, four out of five, some good ideas, some interesting colors, short sleeve, bumped it down a notch easily. The brown and black shoes, bumped it down right around there. So that's a review. Thank you for joining us here at the Dapper House for our Stitch Fix unboxing review. If you liked this review or had any comments or suggestions, please note them down below. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and stay dapper out there.